Hi loves and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we've got a massive Zara haul for you. It's been quite a while since we did a Zara haul on my channel so I'm excited to get this up for you. Tons of stuff to get through so let's get started but if you haven't subscribed, if you're new here, I'm Sophie and I put fashion content out every Sunday so don't forget to subscribe before you leave. I'll pop my Instagram on top of the screen as well if you want to come check it out throughout the video. I'll leave that there for you and let's get started. Okay starting off with this orange shirt, this colour I love at the minute. I don't know why but I'm just gone obsessed with it. Like I think I bought like four or five things this colour in the last month and I hope that it's not one of them things like you know the green that came out and everyone loved but actually that's kind of still going like the Bottega green and now I feel like it's the orange. It's the new colour and I love 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 it. So this reminded me of like Rat and Boa vibes. I don't know if you um, know the brand Rat and Boa but they do this kind of silky feel dresses with the similar sleeve and they're quite expensive so when i saw this i was like oh that really is giving me rat and boa vibes so i wanted to try it absolutely love it on the color is just the winner for me and also it just feels like quite weighted it's quite heavy it's got like that silky thing i think it looks a little bit more expensive than it was i got it in a size small and it was 32.99 this one we're gonna move fast today because I want this video to be under 15 minutes because I don't want you to get bored. So we're gonna go through, but I am Welsh, so obviously my accent's quite strong, so I'm gonna try and not talk that fast. So I hope you can understand me so far. I'll try and slow it down slightly. Love this dress. I actually saw this on Instagram and look at the back. The back detail on this, so, so nice. Love the neckline. I love this neckline. I think it's so, so flattering on. I got this in a size small. It was 49 99 And I do think this is just a nice one to have in your wardrobe. Like, it's a black dress. Everyone's got, like, a little black dress in their wardrobe. But I actually haven't got a black midi dress. So that's why I thought, oh, let me give this one a go. I had it on. I do really like it. But I just don't know about this material. So I'll try and hold it. Obviously, for £50, you don't expect it to be super luxury material. But I don't know, it's just like this kind of, it's just not, I don't know, it's not giving something. I don't know if something's missing with this one. But I do love it and I do love the back as well. So actually let me know what you think on this one. Yeah, I got this in a small and I do think it fits fine, that one. So next up we have this little white cord. It's not a matching set online, but I just thought it would look really nice together. So we'll start off with the skirt. So this is the skirt. It's kind of like giving chiffon. It looks like chiffon. It's not, I'm sure it's not chiffon. But um, it looks like it is, yes, definitely not. <laughs> For the price in Zara, let me tell you how much this was. Uh, this was 45 99 I got this in a small. I love that the belt is like a different material, giving it like a little bit of a contrast. This is the belt. And I just thought that it was cute. I don't really like it, but I'm not sure how much wear I would get out of this. This is a little bit I'm unsure of as well. Because although I love it on, I think it's a strong like outfit for one time. Like I think it looks lush with the white top. How much wear am I actually going to get out of this skirt? I'm not so sure. But I wanted to include it because I thought maybe if you have got, maybe like this would be nice for like a christening or like if you've got like a little bit of an event you need to go to, I think this would work really well. I'm just not sure how much weight I would get out of this personally. And then the top I'm wearing without is this little one shoulder. I do think I would get a lot more weight out of this because it's super versatile. I could mix this up with a couple of different things. I love it. I think it's super cute. It's small and this was 19.99. I do love a puff sleeve. Like you'll see me wearing like lots of sleeve details. Not today because it is so hot in London today. I'm literally sweating in my flat. <laughs> but um, I do love a puff sleeve. Next up we have this little top which I love. This is one of them I do think that looks more expensive than it is. So it's kind of like this knitted material and it's so, so nice on. I love the buttons on this, like the detailing on these buttons. I think this one really makes it look like it's kind of Nozara. The buttons and then it's got like a sort of a little slit at the bottom. You'll see it on. And I just thought this is so cute and so versatile. And I do think like this is one of the ones you can have for years and years. And the material, I just really like the material on this one. So I got this in a small, it was $25.99. I probably could have got the extra small as well, but I thought, you know what, this is comfy, it's really cute. I've just popped around with these black trousers, but I think you could wear this a ton of different ways. Okay, my favourite outfit next from this haul. I normally do a favourite outfit first, I don't know why I've left it till the middle of the video this time, but my favourite outfit from this haul. You would have already seen this on my Instagram. How nice is this? Stop, Zara! Like, what? When I got this, I was like, oh, wow. I just, 
I'm literally speechless. I love, love, love it. The day it came and got delivered, I wore it out that night. Like, when I put it on, I was like, mm, this is stunning. I can't cope. This is my favourite thing from the haul. I got it in a small. I've taken the tag off, but I think it was maybe like £30. Definitely worth it. I'm going to wear it a ton. I'm going to keep it forever. I almost wanted to buy a second one in case this one breaks. I actually wore a brace at the night and I got it caught a little bit and I was like nearly crying. I was like, no, please. I love this. Please don't let it break. I was like looking down, like getting the bracelet out of it slowly. So I popped it on with a skirt. I normally don't buy skirts from Zara because I'm five foot ten and it's a struggle to get things long enough for me. But with a one with the shorts underneath, I think I can get away with it. If this was a skirt, I would have had to send it back because it would have been way too short. But because it's got the shorts, I feel like I can get away with a little bit more. If that makes sense, I feel comfortable. So I got this in a medium and it was 29.99. I am gonna have to have the waist nipped in a little bit. Next up we have these trousers. I mean, I've owned these trousers in another colour from like maybe three years ago and I still wear them all the time. And I was I'm in an arm whether to get these because I've bought similar, I have got quite a few, you know, neutral trousers. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep them, but I do really love them. I feel like this is Zara classic, like this suits. If you follow me on Insta, you would have seen like I went through a strong phase of wearing these suits all the time. So I just picked up the trousers this time. I didn't get the jacket because I've got enough blazers in my wardrobe. It comes with a little belt, which I find very flattering because normally I do have to take the waist in on things. So this is helpful because then I can just tie a little bit tighter and they fit me a little bit better these are just perfect for work like if you need a pair of work trousers these and the gray ones i'm going to talk about later from zara so good for like office vibes i got these in a size small and they were 32.99 i'm sweating it is so hot in my flat my hair is wet that is not even a joke i don't know if you can see it my hair is wet from like my sweat which is disgusting I don't even have to cut that out I think <laughs> so next up we're going to talk about this little set I've actually got the shorts on today um this is just like the thing the shirt that goes over it super light nice for summer I think again it's something I can keep forever it's not going to go out it's a neutral color so it'll be totally fine um I got this in a size small it was 32.99 and then obviously I've got it on with this little course this is actually from another stories and the shirt and then just pop this over it I just thought you know it's a nice chill one pop with some trainers on if you're going for like a Sunday brunch or whatever it's just so so comfy and if you are new here I love comfy things like if something's comfy it's a winner for me next up we have this little top I bought this in black as well but I actually can't find it so I literally had the delivery the other day and I've lost it since then but uh, my flat is a bit of a mess at the minute so I will find the black one and you will see it on me but just not in this video I'll link them both below anyway but um I just love this like I just I think it's so so nice it came out in long sleeves the other day and everyone had it and it was sold out and I was devastated I didn't get it in the long sleeve version so then when they brought the short sleeve version I was like let me get a black and white one just before they sell out and then I also picked up this little bralette to wear underneath because I do have a white bralette from, from Zara from a while back but it's too big so it does look a bit weird on me so I just thought let me get one in my size to wear underneath this obviously because I don't want you to be able to see my bra I think like a simple bralette just looks really nice underneath these t-shirts so I got these t-shirts in a size small they were 19.99 and the bras I also got in a small it was 20 25 pounds for a bralette why is that so expensive why is a bralette more expensive than the t-shirt I'm not sure it must be some sort of nice material it does feel soft to be fair it, it does feel super soft so it must be something to do with that but yeah um i think this is nice with just like a white pair of trousers or you can mix it up with a few different things next up we have the blue suit i'm not sure whether i'm going to keep this need your opinions i love it the, the waist cut fits perfectly i just don't know whether the trousers are a little bit short obviously i'm um, five foot ten so i don't know like sometimes i feel like because i've always think things are too short for me because they mostly are now even if something's long enough i'm like it's too short so like i said to claudio do you like these and he was like yeah they're long enough definitely because they're not touching the floor i feel like they're not long enough like they're like this much off the floor and i do think that might bother me but i wanted to include it because obviously if you're a little bit shorter than 510 this is stunning i love the color i love the fit on this and i just thought the material is so nice like it looks like a linen cotton mix i'm not sure what it is 
Um, I got the trousers in a size medium and I got the top in a, I think it was an extra small, no, a small. Top was 29.99 and trousers were 32. I want to find out the material because it feels so, so nice. 50% viscose, 35% cotton and 15% linen. Yeah, I thought it was a linen mix. It is really nice on. And I, I hate full linen things because it gets so, so creased. Obviously, I've got a couple of things fully linen, but it just doesn't work. Like, it just gets so, so creased. So I do like a linen mix with cotton. Sorry, there's sirens in the background. Welcome to London. <laughs> Living in Central means you will always have one type of siren in a video. <laughs> okay, next up we're gonna talk about these jeans and I actually really need to know your opinion on this. I don't know. I've never ever worn things that are not high-waisted and I do know this low-waist trend is in right now and I didn't think I would take part. But I did buy a long, uh, low waist pair of trousers the other day with a turn up, but I did really like the way they looked. So then I was like, can I rock this outfit or am I too old? <laughs> I'll show you the full outfit. This is the jeans, they've got like a tie, they they say high rise, they say mid rise regular, but the girl on the website had them really, really low. So I don't know, like you'll have to wait and see it on. I got these in a UK 10, they were 32 pounds. They're just very like baggy, straight fit long enough obviously because i've worn them so low and then i popped them on with this denim bra i mean who am i who do i think i am rocking this outfit i don't know like i thought it was giving mew mew vibes but i just don't know this is the braless i mean it's a little bit of a different denim probably that's where i've gone wrong initially but i just don't know if i can rock this anyway even as separate pieces are the jeans too low cut? Should I keep them and wear them maybe with like a like some sort of crop? And am I actually gonna get my way over this or am I just trying to get like the Mew Mew lookalike where I'm never ever gonna wear? Because I can't rock that little mini skirt, like the pleated one, because it's obviously too short. They did have the matching denim mini skirt, which is obviously the look they wanted people to go for, but there's no way I'm gonna be able to get that. Like, obviously I'm tall, that's not happening. I got this in a small, this was 25.99. Even the way I'm talking about it, I just don't know if this is for me, but I've included it anyway in case it's for you, and I kind of want to know your thoughts. Am I just trying to be younger than I am because I'm turning 30 this year and I don't know. <laughs> Another pair of work trousers I just wanted to include in case you are looking for like office outfits. I do do a lot of office outfits reels on my Insta as well if you want to see them um, because I know you all need office outfits. I'm not in the office anymore but I know some people are so I like to do them. I got these in a small and they were 25 99 I love the colour, they're so soft, they're so comfy. Perfect office trouser, wear with a white shirt or like a little black t-shirt or you can wear it with so many. Like options are endless with these trousers. I own them in a couple of different colours and I've had them years and they do last really well. Okay and lastly we have another denim look. I mean who do I think I am with all these denims? I'm not sure. But we've got this denim corset. I do love a denim corset and I actually picked up another one as well. There is no on the rail but I will show you a little clip of now. I picked this one up as well and then I pick this one up, I'm gonna choose between the two. So which one do you prefer? The button up or the plain? Originally I thought the plain, but now the button up's come. I do quite like the button up. So I'm gonna send one of them back, I just don't know which one. I got them both in a small, they were both around 25 pounds. And then I popped that on with these jeans. Again, I'm not sure about these jeans. I said, I did a little Zara keep return on my Insta and I wrote return on the jeans, but a couple of people said keep. I do like them. I just thought they were a bit odd fitting. High rise, full length. I got these in a UK 10, 38, 29.99. Again, they're a little bit big on the waist, but I've done, I'm not mad about it because they're super comfy. So I feel like I could wear them a little bit lower. I would love to get like a really, um, like a designer pair of like boxers to wear underneath and then wear that over so you could just see the line. But um, they're quite expensive and I don't know how many times I would rock that look. <laughs> so I don't know if it's worth it. I am thinking about it though. So yeah, I do really like these. They've got a split hem. Again, I'm not sure if they're long enough. They are, but they're not touching the floor. I could wear them. It would never be with heels. But I think I could probably pull them off if I wanted to keep them. I'm just a little bit unsure. But I don't have anything like this. So that's why I ordered them. Because I thought they were going to be a winner. But I'm just a little bit unsure on these. So to finish off, I thought I would show you these accessories. I'm sending them back because I ordered them because I loved the orange and I thought you could wear it with all my oranges. But the only thing is my oranges are this, like burnt orange and these have come and they're luminous. I wanted to show you in case you were thinking of ordering them. 
they look really different to on the website like they're so luminous in person and i just got nothing to go with this luminous orange color so i'm gonna have to send these back uh they were 32.99 i got them in a size nine because i have a huge feet because i'm tall I'm actually a size eight but um i normally buy stuff in eight or nine i do love them and they feel really soft i imagine they would be comfy but they just don't go with enough of my stuff so i'm sending these ones back and that is it for me today i actually flew through that haul i hope you enjoyed it let me know in the comment section if you did and if you want to see more of these type of videos do not forget to subscribe and come follow me on instagram and i'll see you next sunday